Now time to finish, uh, or at least attempt to finish Resident Evil, the Resident Evil 4 playthrough. I think it can be done because there's only like three more main sections of the game left. There's the Krauser fight, there's the war zone, and then there's that like weird section before Sadler and then the Sadler fight. So I'm, like I consider that last part like two and one, so... If all goes well, this shouldn't take any more than, like, two hours. That's what I'm shooting for, is to try to have this whole thing done in, like, two hours. If not, fair enough, but we'll see. I don't expect that there will be any viewers, but we'll see. Also, I just got out of the shower, so my hair is, like, really shiny. It's gonna be time for a cutscene here. So, you two are all hooked up now, is that it? Where's Ashley? Do you really want to know? I'm just gonna browse Twitter while she's this beyond plays. that gate. But you'll need three insignias to open it. What are you gonna do, Krauser? There's one in the north, and the other in the east. And let me guess you got the last one. It pretty much means you're on a tight leash. Sounds like you thought this one out pretty well. So... This section is not that bad. Um, I will probably find some way to monumentally fuck this up, but I usually don't struggle with this. Ah! Broke the barricade. So I like to use the Magnum against Krauser because uh, it's a really easy way to. So here, let me explain why. So the reason I like to use the Magnum here against Krauser is because there is a damage threshold for Krauser. He has like, I guess the easiest way to kind of uh, simplify it would be to say that like each little mini section uh, here, he has a health bar, and when you deplete that health bar, he'll throw a flash grenade and then he'll stop attacking you, and then that'll allow you to continue on to the next section. So, shooting him a couple times with the Magnum should, uh, facilitate that change. So, let's let him... Uh, boom! Unfortunately, he... Jesus! He jumps around a lot. He jump. He likes to jump around a lot. Let's see. There we go. Like I said, he. I normally don't struggle, but I will probably find some way to uh, make myself look awful. I've had kind of a track record of doing that today. Ooh, three shots. I'll take that. Hell yeah. Three magnum bullets. So there's really nothing else in the game uh, besides Sadler that you really need the magnum for. Uh, so this is um, fine. Some people could say just use the knife on him right now, but I don't like using the knife in this section. I like using the magnum. I think it's easier. The knife is, of course, the best thing to use against him. Oh. Well, I was going to try to do the whole walk backwards and then run away trick, but he's... He's spawned. Okay, so there's the flash grenade. Let's reload, just to be safe. Oh, take them shotgun shells. It's always nice to have. We'll go this way. And grab this. This is the exit, but we're not ready to go there yet. We are not ready for the exit. No, sir. button mash your way. So I want to fight him in here. I don't want to fight him outside. Oh, that was a waste of a shot. Um, oh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Ah, that was close. What I just said kind of reminded me of Mrs. Incredible. She says that in the beginning of The Incredibles, where she's like, leave all the save in the world to the men. I don't think so. I don't think so. That's what I just did. 
Is there really nothing up here? Okay, whatever. So, yeah. As you can see, this section's not that bad. Uh, okay, yeah, no items around the house or anything. Alright, fair enough. There's a green herb here. I'll definitely take that. I'll take any healing items I can get. Yes, sir, I will. Turn up the lights in here, baby. Extra bright on what y'all to see. What do you intend to do restoring Umbrella? To bring order and balance to this insane world of ours. A psycho like you can't bring order or balance. You don't seriously think a conservative mind can chart a new course for the world, do you? Who knows? Alright. So, for this, just like, stay under here, and eventually he'll come down here and he'll come after you. Oh, well, like that. I didn't think he came down that quickly. Usually he likes to... Oh, that was not the right weapon. Um, normally he likes to stay up there and kind of... I missed. Got his hat. Um, yeah, normally he likes to stay up there for a bit longer and uh, kind of throw grenades and shoot you with the TMP and stuff, so... Uh, I was kind of surprised that he came down that quickly, but I'm not complaining because uh, that's shaving time off of this run, which, quite frankly, is what I'm looking for at this point. This has been a really mixed run um, of this game. It started off extremely well. In fact, uh, the run started with me doing better than I've like ever done uh, playing RE4. Pretty much all of the village went silky smooth, and then... I got to the castle, and that was, like, and that was really rough. There were some really rough parts of the castle. Man, I'm telling you, it was bad. It was really, really bad. But, it is what it is. I think now, yeah, this will be open. Whoa! I forgot he shows up there. He's quite the gymnast. Alright. TMP ammo, nice, I'll take that. We're actually going to be using the TMP for this section, incidentally. <gasps> rifle ammo! Well, not that I need rifle ammo, but it's still cool to have. More rifle ammo that I... Oh. Gotta be careful. These are... These little robots are not difficult to avoid. Man, they really what are... What is it that you fight for, comrade? Feeding me ammo. Past, I suppose. <laughs> Umbrella. Ha! <laughs> Umbrella. Damn it. I thought I could get away. Oh well. Unfortunately, not quite. Alright, pretty soon here, we'll be fighting Krauser. In earnest. And he can be tricky. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and go straight to the beast slate. Uh, I'll worry about the items after. Oh, my back. Two down, one more to go, Krauser. <laughs> we'll see about that. Oh. Witness 
the power! Witness the power! You've lost it completely, Krauser. Prepare for your death, Leon. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna back off and then let him come to us when there's a little more room. Oh shit, that hit me with a, a sweeping kick. Alright, let him come over here. Oh, come on! With the cutscenes. Oh, you're ready to do the destination thing? As you can see, uh, Krauser is uh, kind of a chump if you use the knife. It's not hard. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and grab this ammunition and stuff. Alright, so we gotta go ahead and jump down here. Make sure I don't get this. Sometimes I get like... Okay, yeah, there we go. So we'll go ahead and put in these pieces of the puzzle. And yeah. So that Krauser section actually went really smoothly, uh, Spark. It went very, very well. All right, I'm gonna leave this screen here for now because I need to go, uh, I need to go help Trevor with something real quick. So I will be back in a bit. <clears throat> Sorry about that, I had to help Trevor uh, lift some stuff. But yeah, I'm feeling pretty good now. I'm all refreshed and everything because I had some food and I took a shower, so I'm feeling a lot better. Especially, I got to see the new shower curtain today while I was showing because we... I don't know why I'm saving again, but we got a new shower curtain and it looks really nice. It's a pretty, uh, like a pretty night sky design with a moon on it and stars. Krauser, too. How shall I return my appreciation? What are you talking about? I thought he was with you. <laughs> what are you talking about? Did you really think I'd trust an American? To tell you the truth, I was contemplating how to get rid of him. But thanks to you, that's no longer necessary. You were just using him right from the start. Oh, I must hand it to you. You've demonstrated quite a bit of promise by killing Krauser. When your assimilation with Las Plagas is complete, I'll have you serve as my guard. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to decline your generous offer. I have prior engagements. <laughs> Enjoy your smart mouthing while you can. Nice. All right, now we come to by far and away my least favorite section in all of Resident Evil 4. My my second least favorite was what, the water room from the castle. This area is my least favorite. I hate this fucking area. It's so terrible. Like I just think it's legitimately bad. Damn. about time. Sorry, bad traffic. I'll cover you. This cutscene is pretty cool. Though. I'll give it that.
That's what I call backup. My name is Mike. If you're looking for firepower, you come to the right place. All right, Mike. So here's how we're gonna do this. We're gonna equip the rifle. Try to take care of as many enemies as we can from a distance. We'll wait in here for a little bit, just until... Just until, uh, Mike can take care of it. There we go. Okay, here. Here's these items. This, Mike did us a little service. This is why the war zone's my least favorite, because there's just so fucking many enemies, and a lot of them are in really terrible spots that you literally can't do anything about. And Mike is fucking useless. Yeah, he, he does shoot the enemies on the guns, but it takes him so long to do it. Like, on, if I wasn't streaming, it'd be fine. But I can't just sit around and go there and stream and wait for money to shoot or shit. I, I can't. I can't just wait. Alright. Finally. Glad to be done with that. Nothing from here on in for the rest of the game is even remotely that bad. Nothing even comes close to being as shit as that section is. Get out of here, drinks are on me. Yeah, hey, I know a good bar. No. Mike! Damn. It's a rough way to go. They were, they were gonna be, they were gonna chill. I'll make sure you're the next to go, Sadler.
Ooh, I'm sorry, Leon. Sadler, you bastard. Dick. Yeah, rip my nothing to get all upset about. Don't tell me you've never swatted a bothersome fly. In essence, it's the same thing. What did you say? Insects' life doesn't compare to human lives. When you've acquired this power, you too will understand. Guess it's another good reason to get the parasite out of my body. <laughs> I wish you luck. Oh, you shouldn't have done that, Sadler. See, if you hadn't wished Leon good luck, he would have never done it. He'd have never been able to get the parasite out. But now that you've wished him luck, he's going to be able to do it. You have essentially sealed your own fate with ink. If you look over the edge of the cliff where Mike was shot, it says, Mike, I'll make sure they pay. And it shows, like, the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald, no, I mean, of Mike's helicopter. That's a good song, Wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald. It's a really beautiful song. I enjoy it. But yeah, like I was saying, there's there's nothing. I mean, it's gonna be mostly a cakewalk from here on out. There's nothing even fucking remotely close to being that difficult from here on in. Not even close. That war zone area is just fucking... A, it's a dumpster fire. It's so shitty. Leon. You okay? Yeah. That sound effect is in uh, Rayman 2, The Great Escape of the Lamp Swinging. It's in Rayman 2. That might be what I play for the next stream. I wish I was able right now. See, those two know how to play rough. Sorry, Ada. Nah, I'm, I'm just kidding. I made that joke like five times during this, uh, during this playthrough. We have to get that parasite out of your body. Yeah, but before that, I gotta save Ashley. Fine, let's split up. All right. There was a. There was a, uh, a scene earlier in the game where Chief Mendez, like, takes the handlebars of the door and then twists them together. I know, for real. That would be, that would be a privilege. I don't know why Ada wanted him to stop. I wonder what's in there. It do he do he do be dancing. Bro, chill, this is not America's Got Talent. You can relax. So we're going to go ahead and equip the shotgun here. Because there's a regenerator. And we're going to kill it just because. I don't have to. I mean, you can just avoid this one. But I think killing regenerators is fun. I don't know. I like knifing them. I think it's fun to knife them. Bonk. 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 There he goes. seems to be taking a lot longer than the other ones took. The other ones I don't think took this long. There we go. Very nice. Get some shmoney. Go ahead and grab this red herb. And let's see, anything interesting in here? I don't remember if there's anything in any of these rooms. I almost, I usually never check these rooms. Gross. Uh, do, 
he still do be dancing in there. I can hear him. Rifle ammo? Cool, we'll take that. And... Nothing. Alright. Wait, I think there was a typewriter that I... Yeah, I forgot to save. Let's do that real quick. Boop. I need to really consider what I need to do for my next, like, streams. If I should take a break from Resident Evil stuff and go back to Overwatch. Or if I should play more Resident Evil, or if I should do, like, other games. I don't know. I have no idea. If I did do that, I, I mean, I wouldn't know really what to do. That's fine. I need to use all this rifle ammo. I need an opportunity to use all this rifle ammo. Where's JJ? Come on. Is he coming? Doesn't JJ just like... There he is. Okay. these barrels from a safe distance just because oh well that tended ended up being in my benefit um i just don't want to blow the, have them blow up like when i'm walking near them quite frankly stay down all right this section is really not that bad truthfully there's just a lot of enemies here but we have more than enough ammunition to deal with all of them we have a ton of ammo. Bitch. Suplex City. I love Suplex City. It's my favorite place to visit. Alright. So, we'll get that later. What's in here? Oh, gold. That I don't really need, I should say, but... TMP ammo, hell yeah, we'll take that. TMP ammo is never a bad thing. Alright. I hear Mr. Stunstick. Very nice. Whew, alright. Let's combine these. Look how much fucking rifle ammo I have, dude. I'm really trying to use as much rifle ammo as I can, but I, I should have used it, uh, like, back when, uh, back when I was, like, I'm gonna try to find out where they are, where all the enemies are. But yeah, back when I was, like, killing all the regenerators and stuff, I should have used the rifle uh, instead of doing the knife method, because honestly, I have so much leftover rifle ammo. Where are the enemies? What? There they go. I was gonna say, where the hell are these enemies, man? Ah, uh, here we go. Him. Oh, nice. Glad I 
decided to check all that stuff. Now we go ahead and grab. Ooh, hand grenade. Amazing. Okay, so we need to come back here again. Then we go here. Do this. Alright, then we go back. That's all the enemies dead, hell yeah. See, like I said, that section is child's play. It's not bad. Ah, nice peace and quiet. We can walk our way into the next section. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Ooh, items, shotgun shells, green herb, grenades. Damn, dude, this is the good stuff. Oh, we're almost done, Spark. This is crazy. We are literally almost done. Just pretty much gotta go do the Krauser boss fight, and that's it. And of course, we have to do the thing where we ride like the jet ski. She is. You'll soon harbor an awesome power. Yet it seems you would rather choose death. I'm taking Ashley back, whether you like it or not. Ah, oh, the audacity of youth. Audacity. It's a good program. It just shows that the bullets don't do anything to me. Nice. This isn't even going to take close to two hours. I thought I was going to take like two hours from the time, uh, from the time I started streaming, but it's only been like. 40 minutes, so maybe this will be done in like an hour, maybe? Not in an hour, but like by an hour, so maybe in like another 20 minutes or so, the stream will be over. Or, well, the game will be over. I gotta figure out what I wanna do for my next set of streams. If I wanna go, back, like I said, if I wanna go back to Overwatch, or if I wanna, uh, if I wanna, like,
Holy fucking lust blocks. No, oh god, 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 oh god. Die, please. Just die. Thank you. No less progress, just die. Just die, please. Then we get this cutscene. This There's junk? a lot of cutscenes in this I don't last know part of the this, game. Leon. There's only one way to find out. You operate. I love how the machine is just like she yeah. pushes a button and it works. All right, here goes nothing. They just happen to know how to operate this machine. How are you feeling? Like a million bucks. I thought you were gonna die. All right. <laughs> so would I. I'm Don't up. worry. <laughs> that seemed a bit suggestive. You okay? Capcom knew what they were doing. I don't know about you, but I think it's time we go home. Yes. Up next, the final chapter. Crazy. Wacky. Alright, well, we're done. Our mission. <clears throat> the real power of the United States lies in three areas, the Justice Department, the administrative bodies, and the military. In order to take control of these areas, we must influence the minds of the people who advise the President. After this is done, the rest of the departments will quickly fall under our sway. If by chance the United States were to figure out our plan, the damage caused should be minimal. We will still be able to conquer the country as planned using our backup plan. Once we control the country, we will use their international influence to our advantage. The rest of the world will fall swiftly. As already stated, if our first plan doesn't go as smoothly as expected, we'll proceed with our secondary plan. By sending in our special forces, we will infiltrate the country from within. Fear and chaos will sped, spread through the nation like a virus. It'll only be a matter of time before the country loses its stability. At that time, when they're most vulnerable, we will strike. Rejoice, my brethren. The world shall soon be cleansed. Yeah, I don't think so. Not if we can help it. Not if we can help it. We're gonna, we're gonna make sure that that does not come to fruition. Welcome. Right, merchant. It wouldn't have been possible without you. A selection of what are you selling? Quite literally, would not have been possible without you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Let's get the striker tune up. <laughs> Thank you. Get the rifle tune up. Thank you. Come back nice. any time. All right, uh, we'll go ahead and get this. Don't let it grow up in that ghetto university. Definitely more than well enough equipped to take on Sadler. Something's not right. Ashley, you stay here. 
book. At the... Ada! Better try a new trick, cause that one's getting old. You okay? I've been better. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, I think you know. The American prevailing is a cliché that only happens in your Hollywood movies. Oh, Mr. Kennedy, you entertain me. To show my appreciation, I will help you awaken from your world of clichés. That's hot. Ada, stand back. I really enjoy this fight. I find it fun. So right out of the gate, one thing you can do is equip a hand grenade, throw it, right, and then equip the magnum, and then... Oh, I just went the wrong way. There we go. I'll ignore those shotgun shells. Alright, so next, we're gonna equip the TMP. Get over here. Magnum again. Okay. Now we're gonna go ahead and equip another hand grenade. Okay, just like that. Equip another grenade. Actually, let's heal real quick. And then equip the Magnum again. I think you get the idea. Okay, so we're done with that. So now what we have to do is we have to turn around and run up here. Right. Yes, thank you. Wait for him to come over here. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, he can do that. Yes. Alright, come here. Get over here. Okay, do this. Alright, now instead of using the Magnum, instead, this time we're just gonna climb up and then stab him in the face. That is what we need this time. We'll go ahead and heal again. Move our shit around. Try to get up past him like that if we can. Alright, good. Very nice. Alright, let's get another hand grenade. Climb up here. Take this. Wait for him to come over. He might knock the thing at us again. That's fine if he does. It won't bother me if he does. Okay. Stab in the face again. Boom. Okay, see if we can get past him. Let's go ahead and equip the TMP. You'll see why. Because there's another explosive barrel. Yep, I knew that was coming. One or two more times of doing this, and we should be ready to get the special rocket launcher. Alright, let's go ahead and equip another hand grenade, toss it. Let's also go ahead and just heal, just for the fuck of it. And, uh, 
Let's go ahead and use the map again. Oh, you can do both? Shit, I didn't know you could do both. Alright, well, now we should definitely be able to have that rocket launcher. Yeah. I was gonna say, a magnum shot and the fucking thing. Yeah. Okay, he might whack us. That's fine. Alright. Let's go over here. Alright. Let's equip the rocket launcher and let's end this game. Hell yeah. Very cool. I like how the reward money shows up in the cutscene, that's funny. Sorry, Leon. Hand it over. Ada, you do know what this is. Hmm. Ada. I want to know how she jumped from above the helicopter and got in without getting shredded to pieces by the helicopter blades. Here, catch. Better get a move on. See you around. Very cute. All right, time to book ass. Bye, Sadler. Oh. Well, now it's time to get out of here. Watch me die on the jet ski section. That would be the second death for me. Yeah. We have to get off this island now. It's gonna blow any minute. It's gonna what? <laughs> it's gonna what? Damn, Leon should have broken his legs. Yes. Fall that high? God damn. All right, jet ski time. Hang on, sweetheart. All right. Let's go. Sad part is if you if you uh, fuck up and die here, you have to do everything all over again. You can't just do the the first part. You have to do you have to do all of it. We're good though. We got it. We got it. First try. Very nice. Go home. Sounds like a great idea. Mission accomplished. Right, Leon? Not quite. I still have to get you home safe. So, uh, after you take me back to my place, how about we do some, um, overtime? <laughs> Sorry. Somehow I knew you'd say that, but it doesn't hurt to ask, you know? 
So, who was that woman anyway? Why do you ask? Come on, tell me. She's like a part of me I can't let go. Let's leave it at that. Ata. That's it, Resident Evil 4. We did it. The music here kind of reminds me of uh, the music at the end of a Disney movie, a really old Disney movie called The Black Cauldron. But yeah, we'll skip that. Characters and events depicted in this game are fictitious. Any similarity to actual persons living or dead is purely coincidental. This game is predicted under the laws of the Raccoon City Police Department. On other has duplication, distribution, or exhibition of remains may result in civil liability. See, I read it that quick and it still isn't Hunnigan, enough time for you? me to read the whole fucking Finally, thing. The line so stupid. Free. Hey, Hunnigan, no glasses. Forget the glasses. What's the status of the mission? I've rescued the subject. We're returning home. You did it, Leon. Thanks. You know, you're kind of cute without those glasses. Give me your number when I get back. May I remind you that you're still on duty? Story of my life. Damn. Hunnigan, man. She's crazy. <laughs> Turning that down. Alright, let's see how I did. Hit ratio, 70%. Enemies killed, 765. Number of times killed, 1. Clear time, 9 hours, 14 minutes, 30 seconds. Shit. No, let's not upload that to the leaderboards. You can, buy, you can now buy the infinite launcher and Matilda from the merchant. Yes, thank you. Save. Yes. Thank you. Oh, all right. And that's it. That's the game. So, that being done now, I have to really think about my content going forward because... I've kind of exhausted, you know, the, um, I've exhausted my impressiveness in a sense where, um, Resident Evil 1 was really the peak. I mean, that was an extremely impressive stream and, uh, you know, the, the people that watched it really liked it. And my Resident Evil 4 stream started off really impressive. Um, but towards the end, I just really, really, really shit the bed and had a lot of problems, so uh, there's really no other Resident Evil game that I'm good at to the extent that I am is even this. Like Resident Evil 5, I mean, I, I have a lot of experience and knowledge with Resident Evil 5. Um, I would just need, like, the, but the problem is I can't do it with the, with the uh, AI, with the partner AI. I always like to play Resident Evil 5 with another actual person because I can't rely on Sheva's AI. It sucks. Um, so, you know, I could do Resident Evil 5, I could do Resident Evil 7, but the, the simple fact of the matter is I've now reached the point where it's like nothing I do is going to impress people anymore. Like, because I'm not, I'm not good enough to do, like, walkthrough content or strategy content um, I'm not, I'm not entertain, like entertaining enough to just do content where I'm not acing everything I'm doing. So it's tough. I, I, my base instinct is to go back to Overwatch. Um, that's probably what I'm going to do is just go back to streaming Overwatch. But if, if I get anybody telling me to do anything else or giving me any other suggestions, I'll definitely take heed of that. But, um, yeah, that's, again, that's just something I really have to think about. But I digress. That is Resident Evil 4. I did mostly have fun with the playthrough. There was some really bullshit parts, but I mostly had fun with the playthrough. So that being said, take care. Have a good night. Have a good day. Have a good afternoon, evening, whatever. I'm out.